All right, I'm at the uh, Ames uh, CNH Ag Information Center. This uh, garage area is as big as an aircraft hangar because it uh, has to be able to handle a lot of ag equipment. This is, this is Al. Good morning. Al and I were here together for a class this week on the new sprayers, 50 series Case IH sprayers. So what we have here is an AFS Connect uh, Magnum 380 model. And it's hooked to a planter. 2150 AFS planter, early riser. And this is how you hook them up to the tractor. Bunch of hydraulic hookups. There's electrical hookups, communication hookups, modern stuff. Moving on. We have a basled and built Puma 240 AFS tractor. Built in Basildon in the United Kingdom. And it's hooked up to the Case IH VT Flex 435 tillage tool. Now we have a AFS Connect Magnum 240. That's uh, some people call it the Mini Mag or the Mid Range Magnum. It's built in Racine, but it's got a drive line that, or at least the transmission, is built in the United Kingdom. Or in Europe, I should say. And it's hooked to a uh, 2500 E. coli till. This is a smart tillage tool that records um, how deep and how hard that it had to push those knives down into the ground for later analysis in the user's computer. Next, a 5550 Trident sprayer and, and floater. Combination tool, basically. Bazeled and built Puma 165 tractor. Farmall 120C, these are uh, considered to be a utility tractor, barnyard tractor. Farmall 110U. And a smaller one, a Farmall 75A. And then the compact tractor. CNH and Case IH don't make lawn tractors, but they do make these kind of compact tractors, which are one size up from a lawn tractor. Case IH 7250 AFS Connect Combine. It doesn't have a header attached to it. And the Case IH 8250 Combine. We 
got some New Holland equipment here. T5 140 Walker. Master 95 tractor. This is the trailer that they used to do shows and stuff. Pretty cool. Workmaster 50. And they're moving stuff around in here. Workmaster 75. And a New Holland combine. New Holland uses a different combination in their combine. It's a twin rotor. So it's got two big spools that uh, move the grain off of the stocks instead of just the one spool like just what any other combine has. New Holland T6 tractor over here, a T6 180 with a loader on it. 